archdiocese of guwahati building communities reaching out to peripheries assam the gateway to northeast india found a permanent place on the map of the universal church in 1626 when the first foreign missionaries set their foot on its sacred soil Ever since it has been a saga of relentless work building up the society on solid grounds. Fresh pages were added to its marvelous history with the establishment of the diocese of Guwahati on 16th August 1992. Since then it has been a march of unrelenting works to create a society of enlightened citizens living at peace with one another and a prosperous state growing from glory to glory quality education at all levels admirable health care empowering social services economic development were all master strokes aiming at social transformation the archdiocese has some of the best educational institutions of the region shaping lives infusing dreams for nothing less than the stars and building stalwarts for the state and beyond Catholic schools retain their primacy in terms of people's preference despite the presence of many national and international educational institutions with accolades and fame 13 higher secondary schools 40 high schools 15 upper primary schools 3 colleges two research centers and a management institute are the pride of assam assam don bosco university the first catholic university of the country and the first state private university of assam situated within the jurisdiction of the arch diocese gives opportunity for obtaining world class higher education for the youth of the northeast technical education imparted by the catholic institutions since the time of the first missionaries catering specially to the school dropouts and unemployed youth have helped so many to climb the ladder of success adding new feathers to the state's glory the segment of education in the arch diocese embraces warmly the differently able children of the society making them independent self-reliant and pride of the state
the depraved and underprivileged have been brought to the mainstream through education. The various programs undertaken by the Archdiocese of Guwahati are geared towards the economic development, human empowerment, disaster management and social transformation of the people. Regeneration of agriculture, promotion of micro-enterprises and availing of local financial resources are well in focus. Embracing every strata of the society, it conducts human development programs and legal assistance for the empowerment of women, poor and the marginalized. Relief operations during natural disasters, awareness programs to reduce human risks and to avoid the causes of environmental degradation are well in place in the programs. An integrated rural development, community-based rehabilitation of the disabled, orphans, widows and aged and addressing the issues of child labor, human trafficking, alcoholism and drug addiction are the hallmark of archdiocesan social intervention. Catholic Church the largest non-government provider of humanitarian services in the world has around 18,000 clinics, 16,000 homes for the elderly and those with special needs and 5,500 hospitals with 65% of them located in developing countries. Health mission is a mandate of Christ's mission. Health services rendered in Assam are held in high esteem as it reaches out to thousands through hospitals, dispensaries, health centers, mobile clinics, leprosaria and medical camps. Transmitting the inconceivable compassion of Jesus, Catholic hospitals at Guwahati, Naugao, Gualpara and the palliative care center at Ninth Mile care for people without discrimination of caste, creed, color or language. Awareness programs on health and hygiene Preventive measures through medical camps and exhibitions are conducted in rural and urban areas. As silver sparkles on the Archdiocese of Guwahati, her heroic story of building Assam continues impacting peripheries and molding lives. Thus the journey continues in unwavering faith.